In this series, we are exploring the scary animals iceberg. This is part 4, tier 1. Mice Mice are small rodents that can be found all over the world. While they may not appear to be scary, they can pose a significant threat to humans in terms of health and safety. Mice can carry diseases such as hantavirus and salmonella, which can be transmitted through humans through the drop-ins and their urine. Additionally, mice can cause damage to homes and property by chewing through wires and insulation, which can lead to fires or other safety hazards. Frilled Necked Lizards The Frilled Necked Lizard is a unique looking reptile that can be found in Australia and New Guinea. Despite their intimidating appearance, they are not considered to be very dangerous. They are, are actually not aggressive towards us and only display their frills as a defense mechanism. However, if they feel threatened or cornered, they may lash out and bite. Their bite is not venomous, but they can still be harmful. Squids Squids are fascinating creatures that live in the ocean. While they are not typically dangerous to humans, uh, some species can be though, so we'll explore that in the lower tiers. Um, squids are equipped with sharp beaks that can cause harm to humans if provoked or threatened. Additionally, some species of squids are known to be venomous and can use painful stings, but we're getting ahead of ourselves. Frogs. Frogs are amphibians that are found all over the world. While they are generally not considered to be dangerous, some species of frogs can be toxic and pose significant threat to humans. But again, those are reserved for the lower tiers. But for now, we are left with the less aggressive of these in the upper tier. Chinese Giant Salamander The Chinese Giant Salamander is a large amphibian that is native to China. While they are not typically dangerous to humans, they are strong and have sharp teeth that they can use to defend themselves in the wild. They are known to feed on fish and other small aquatic creatures, but again, not known to attack humans. Dwarf Lantern Shark The Dwarf Lantern Shark is a small shark that is found in deep seas. Um, these creatures can grow up to 20 centimeters or 7.9 inches. They are not considered dangerous to humans, but they do have sharp teeth that can cause injury if mishandled. Um, additionally, because they, are, they live in such deep waters, humans will rarely ever encounter them. The sea hare. Sea hare is a type of marine animal that can be found in all oceans of the world. Um, they have a unique defense mechanism. When they are threatened, they can release a purple ink that contains toxins that can cause irritation to the skin and the eyes. Not necessarily super dangerous to humans, but um, it is there to watch out for. Crested Black Macaque The Crested Black Macaque is a species of monkey that is native to Indonesia. They are strong and they do they are known to attack if provoked. In recent years there have been reports of macaque attacks on tourists who have been feeding or interactive with them, but again these monkeys are not considered dangerous, but they have been known to attack. Sea pigs. 
These unsettling looking creatures are a type of deep sea cucumber, sea cucumber that can be found in oceans all over the world. Uh, they are named for their pig-like snouts and can often be found in large groups on the ocean floor. Um, but as you might have guessed, they don't pose threats to humans. Atlas moth. The Atlas moth is a large moth that is found in Southeast Asia. Um, they have a wingspan of about 10 inches, which is just huge. It's about the size of a pencil. And these can be intimidating. Uh, their wings are also covered in fine dust that can cause irritation if it comes into contact with hu human skin or eyes, but that's about it. Um, they don't bite, they're not poisonous, that's all they do. It's not super dangerous to humans. Crows. Crows are intelligent and adaptable birds that can be found all over the world. Um, they are not traditionally known to attack humans, but their dark coloring, their sharp beaks, their airy crying, calling can be very unsettling. In addition, they are known to be highly territorial and will defend their nests aggressively, sometimes swooping down on perceived threats with surprising speed and force. However, crows also have many positive qualities, such as their ability to act as natural pest control and their remarkable problem-solving abilities. Lake Titicaca Frog The Lake Titicaca Frog, also known as the Scrotum Frog due to its distinctive skin folds, is an unusual and somewhat intimidating amphibian found in the high altitude lakes of South America. While they are not venomous or aggressive towards humans, their appearance alone can be unnerving. They can grow up to 20 centimeters or 7.9 inches in length and have a rough bumpy skin that is often modeled with dark spots. In addition, they have unique vocalization that sounds like a cross between a cat's meow and a donkey's bray. Uh, despite their intimidating appearance, the Lake Titicaca frog is an important part of the ecosystem and is considered a delicacy in some regions of South America. Thank you for making it this far. I uh, wasn't able to create videos these past few days, unfortunately, but my goal still continues to be to upload every single day, so you'll definitely see more videos coming. Uh, again, thank you for watching. Subscribe, like, comment. Later.